It's an ML Sports Take brought to you by Bonnet Sales and Service and Burn Dairy. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. You know, a couple of games ago, I thought the Yankees were going to easily lose the series. Uh, they were up multiple runs, Clay Holmes, ninth inning, and they completely fell apart. But the Yankees bounced back. They got a big win and then another win. And you can't say enough about Luis Hill. You can't say enough about, <clears throat> you know, Volpe and Soto and Judge in the lineup. And, of course, Verdugo making plays in the field and at the dish. And they came back and uh, showed some pretty good uh, resiliency there. I, I was pretty surprised. And plus, remember, Castillo went for Seattle yesterday. And Seattle has one of the best pitching staffs in all of baseball. When you get that momentum and a come from behind win, and then you keep rolling out pitchers over and over again, it's kind of hard to stop that steamrolling train from going forward. But the Yankees did just that. It's another encouraging sign for the 2024 Yankees, something I haven't seen out of teams the last few years uh, in the Bronx. And maybe this year is a little bit different. Still a long way to go before. Memorial Day, but a, a really good, strong rebound situation after that horrendous, horrendous collapse a couple of nights ago. ML Sports Take here, brought to you by our good friends at Jam and Beats, Rosie's Corner, and Stanley Law Offices.